Hi guys, I hope you are doing well. Welcome to my channel. In this clip, I want to talk about how we can stream our web view browser uh, within Android device or iOS device or other platforms in Unity. Okay, before that, uh, for video streaming uh, in Unity, I want to ask you uh, to first uh, watch my course on my YouTube channel which is about video share with Photon it means for uh, video streaming uh, between two or more than two devices with a Photon network as you can see in this video I'm talking about how we can share the video between uh, Android device and PC and even having a webcam and I can stream my webcam view under the uh, device but we want to use this mechanism video streaming to streaming uh, 3d web view browser for Android or, or, or even other platform for PC even it works it doesn't matter what is the platform uh, but we can use this uh, web view browser uh, for Android it is really powerful uh, I will share the this uh, link of this uh, video share with pun and course in the description of this video and this uh, package as well uh, I want to continue to working on this package and uh, as you can see in our online stream scene uh, I already uh, downloaded Voplex, uh, um, added to my project. It is the web view uh, for Android. In the web view demos folder, I have a lot of demo scenes. And one of these is Canvas Word Space Demo. As you can see, it is just uh, Canvas. For here it is the web view and it is the keyboard I just need to duplicate this canvas instruction message and scene manager and come over here into the online stream scene I duplicated these files here these objects here canvas uh, web and also isolated on canvas web view profile uh, and prefab and I selected to use native screen keyboard for Android and iOS. It's better than the keyboard of the uh, plugin itself. And here I put the web browser uh, canvas front of the camera. As you can see, it is here, it's almost here. And uh, for having a streaming uh, web browser we should change something in our uh, alone pun uh, I already explained it, uh, what is the pun system for streaming the video first of all uh, whenever you want to be a streamer you should check out the VR view if you want to be the receiver just check on the VR view because it is for receiver or sender and in here, in the main camera, in game view encoder, uh, you must uh, change some settings and uh, configuration for this game view encoder. First of all, the camera and the capture mode has to be main camera or full screen. Uh, the web browser itself doesn't work with render cam. It is the main important thing. First, uh, first you should change the capture mode to main camera. And after that, drag and drop the main camera to this main cam. And in here, you should change some uh, settings for having better streaming quality. It depends on your uh, project's performance or your internet speed. But my suggestion is just first resize to the quarter. If you want to have better quality of a screen, you can choose half or full, but uh, it takes it will be expensive for your network traffic and in here set the quality number equal 40 and set a stream fps equal 10 and after that check jet in gzip mode for reduced network traffic 
check on this one and finally it says about ignore singular texture imagine if we have 30 uh, similar textures it says okay these are similar textures ignore them and don't encode them and send them to the network if we want to have better uh, you know quality and, and better uh, network traffic it should be check on and also have uh, it has for example 30 similar textures if you uh, want to have a smoother camera you can put it 20 but uh, network traffic will be busier than uh, 30 here and uh, final thing is uh, you can change the camera uh, you know rotation or whatever you want uh, for example I put the camera here and I have the rotation for my camera because it is VR and uh, but it's not full screen as you can see it is not full screen but if you want to have a full screen camera just put your camera front of the VR view without having something else something like this for example it depends on your uh, decision for your project for example for me it is just uh, fine here and uh, so uh, the final step final check is uh, you need to have VR view off whenever you want to be sender and whenever you want to be receiver VR view on if you want to change the pun system you can take a look at the uh, video share with pun and uh, tutorial and learn how we can how you can uh, manage the pun system here and in the final part I want to show you what I have done and the result in the left panel it is the view of my Android device and the right panel it is the receiver on my PC look at this For example, I'm searching for flower, and that's it. However, the quality is a little bit low because of my, uh, I know, project settings because it is just for lower Android and uh, the VR project if you want to have better quality you can change your uh, graphics settings and even uh, get the better performance for your device after that after you optimize your project of the graphic settings over here with the quality uh, you can make the better settings for the quality itself for example you can put 60 or 50 it, it would be better uh, you know view quality for your streaming but as you can see we could stream our web view between two different platforms and devices okay I hope this tutorial will be helpful for you. Don't hesitate to ask any question related to Unity, AR, VR, and XR. Subscribe my channel and like this video if you like it. Have a great time. Bye-bye.